Hello everyone, my name is Beverly and welcome or welcome back to my channel. Now, I know the title is a day in the life vlog and you might be wondering why I'm starting the video at night but it's just because I kind of wanted to give a brief intro and explanation of what this vlog is actually about. So I'm filming a, like a day in the life on one of my off days and I put off days in quotation marks because if you do not know I'm currently a law student at the University of Birmingham and as a law student you don't really have quote-unquote off days like there's no day where I'm just sitting there doing nothing sadly um, but I'm calling it an off day because I thank Jesus do not have lectures today I don't have a lecture or a seminar so it's technically like my schedule or like my calendar for school is free but I do have a lot planned for today um, today is a work day for me and I do have to do some stuff for my society so I'm gonna be taking you along with me and just showing you what I do in my off time um, additionally I have shown it but I don't think I've actually talked about it I got a new job um, so I'm one of the student content shapers here at the University of Birmingham and what that means is I basically help with making posts for our Instagram TikTok and YouTube and basically our social media platforms so you might have seen me on like YouTube or Instagram if you follow the University of Birmingham's pages and today I actually have to film a video for our Instagram and it's a video that I did film in welcome week but they did not like the format of that video so they are calling me in for a reshoot and I will be refilming that video and editing that video again just because they had a few notes that on different ways they wanted us to film instead and they showed us like some basic structures that we want to they want us to follow so I will be doing that additionally I do have dance practice so I signed up for a dance class it's a taster session um, if you're a second year you can still sign up for taster sessions by the way like that's not a faster exclusive activity so I signed up for one because I signed up for one last year and I liked it but I didn't like it enough to like sign up for the society but one of my flatmates is actually in that society so I'm signing up because she and one of my really close friends Danielle are in that society and they really like it and they say I will I just need to give it a chance so this is me giving it a chance I'm probably not gonna film it because I'm a horrible dancer but I think it could be a fun way of being like active and like hanging out with friends especially because um, with the way second year is looking I'm not gonna be having a lot of time to hang out with friends um, yeah so I just wanted to come say hello be sure to like and subscribe if you like this video and let me know what parts you like or what parts you want to see more of and if you want to see more like behind the scenes of our film day or like more days in the life videos because I'm more than happy to do this Thank you. 
we're now on the veil, which is great. <sighs> Memories. That's why I used to have picnics and read by myself. Kind of very sad, but not that sad. So I could stand like in the middle. Yeah, that looks good. Not to feed yourself, start carrying inhalers <laughs> around. Like, that could be a great idea. I just finished time check it's 11 or 8 and I just finished work how cool is that I started at like 9 40 and it's now 11 so we finished at like 10 something like 10 40 I'm gonna say it's like an hour of work um, it's so cool though like I'm so happy with how the footage looks they're gonna send it to me and I'm gonna edit it I guess which means I have to edit this vlog like next week's vlog today so right now what I'm doing is I'm heading back to my room because I did not carry a like laptop I carried a handbag today just because I knew the walk I knew how long it was and last time I had like a tote bag on me not great so today I'm just carrying a handbag and I'm gonna pass by this cafe on the way home and like get myself a matcha latte with a shot of espresso and a pump of vanilla because I feel like I've earned it I feel like I deserve to treat myself work I'm going to have coming up and now I'm just questioning do I actually have time for an extra activity on top of all the activities I already have like including work my society and school like do I actually have time to do an extra activity and socialize and meet friends and like study and keep up with segments like that sounds like a lot class I'm doing this whole YouTube thing and I'm trying to do it weekly and if I add something else I'm gonna be forced to do it like bi-weekly instead of weekly like instead of every Sunday I'm gonna do what I had to do at some point in the summer which is every 14 days and that is not what I want to do for this channel I want to be more consistent not less consistent so I don't know we'll see how the class goes if the class is a vibe and I genuinely love 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 it like I don't think I can live without it anymore I will have no choice but to enjoy it I'm sorry I'm not sorry actually 
I do need to pack an extra hair tie just because I don't see this one lasting long. There we go. Actually, this one might work, but I'll pack an extra one just in case. So, yeah, let's go. today so it might take me a while to shower so it might take me a while to get back well I don't know why I'm telling you this it's gonna be like a second for you but it will be like a few hours for me like I'll probably talk to you later in the night hello vlog oh my god so I was just looking at the footage from Wednesday which was my off day and I realized that I actually did not film much like I went to work and then I came back and then I went to a meeting and then I came back and then I went to dance and then I came back and then that night I studied and I didn't really want it to be like a studying video because I kind of like feel like I have so many of those on my channel but since it's Friday and technically an off day I guess I can take you along what I will do so a little rundown it's currently 3 36 p.m. which isn't early because I woke up this morning and I literally just have been studying at my desk the whole morning and going through emails but I have something that I do need to do for work so I have to go to the library to do that and then after that I have a society meeting a different society yeah, at 7 p.m. I have another society meeting so I'm also doing that today I did my nails yesterday by the way I'm doing some I guess we can call them renovations in my kitchen. Made it. 
Okay, we're heading back now. Um, so apparently my account just got set up and they need like 24 hours to finish setting it up. So I'm coming back on Monday because they aren't open on the weekend. But at least it's sunny, I guess. Like, I'm not really sure what to say to that. The guy was lovely though, he was really nice about it. And I was like, I think I was really nice back. I'm hoping because I don't know if my face was just like like really upset because he just kept explaining and explaining and I'm like it's cool it's cool it's, I, I get it I get it so I guess we'll be finishing this on Monday so we won't be finishing the setup in this vlog but that's okay I, I think that's okay with me little thing that's holding all my okay. okay sorry about that so a little explanation on what we're doing here I am actually I guess you can call it renovating my kitchen so the state that my kitchen is in right now is not the greatest and I'm not really like you can see over there you can see over there and a lot of it is because of me so what I've decided to do is I've decided to get some storage for my kitchen which I've never done before so when earlier when I was like I guess I've done this for my bathroom it's the storage card method and I decided to get one but for my kitchen this time so that I can keep some of the stuff that's taking up all the space away and like give people places to prep their food and all that I don't know I'm just feeling a bit guilty about it as well so this is the cart and then I bought a few more things and I think I showed you, I was showing you earlier before my flatmate walked in that I also got like some dividers for my drawer because I meant to get those last year but I think last year my drawer was so big that the things wouldn't like bump into each other when they moved after I closed it but this year they were bumping into each other and it was really getting to me just like opening and failing to close it like it was really a hassle so I finally got those I decided to also get this cart and I like that it's like this mesh material and metallic because the one in my bathroom was plastic which I don't mind because I didn't want metal in my bathroom because I didn't want to deal with rust and potential like hard to clean surfaces but for my kitchen I do prefer it with metallic this brand is actually called Hong Kong this is like a little Thing, but you can find them on Amazon. I will link them in uh, on Amazon. This is like the little manual thing, and everything is like well packaged so far. So I'm really excited. Like seems like simple enough. This is how I'm gonna assemble them together.
forgot that this was a blender yes i was so worried like i was literally about to go and like oh god you're not focused are you i was literally like checking my phone and i was like i was supposed to get a blender today where the hell is my blender it's here i put it in my room oh i was wondering i was like worried Actually, like so lit. It's so pretty. I don't think you can see it yet. I'll try and get a better angle. You can't really see it on camera, but they changed the colors. It's like pink, purple, and blue now. It's so pretty. 